Good morning. Welcome to prayer and coffee for a Monday morning, beginning of the work week. There is an evil in the world. We see it every day on the news. We read about it. John 5, 1 John 5, 19. The whole world lies under the sway of the wicked one. Whatever you believe about God, you have to admit that there is an evil in the world. We've seen too much of it. The Bible also tells us that these evil forces are organized and have territories. In Daniel 10, verse 13, an angel came from heaven and appeared to Daniel and said, For 21 days the spirit prince of the kingdom of Persia blocked my way. Then Michael, one of the archangels, came to help me. There is an unseen spiritual dimension over our communities, our cities, and God has equipped his church to deal with that spiritual dimension through prayer. Ephesians 6, 12, For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against authorities, against the cosmic powers over this present darkness, against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly places. 2 Corinthians 10, 3 and 4, For though we walk in the flesh, we do not wage war according to the flesh. For the weapons of our warfare are not of the flesh, but have divine power to destroy strongholds. I praise God for all those who are in the fight against violence and evil that plague our communities, our nation, the police, the various agencies, faith-based programs. Thank God for what they do. We need them. But Jesus said in Mark 9, 29, this kind cannot be driven out by anything but prayer. So let's pray. Father, we grieve over the violence and the loss of life in our land. And we grieve over the plague of, of violence that has seemed to engulf our communities, our nation. Father, we cry out for our sons and daughters. Jesus, we praise your name. Restore your church to what you have called her to be, a house of prayer with your power and your authority, binding territorial spirits in our cities and our communities and loosing your healing power into our cities, our communities. Beginning now, Lord, we retake the territory the evil one has claimed as his own. We pray from Jude 9, the Lord rebuke you. We pray from Zechariah 3, 2, the Lord rebuke you, Satan. The Lord who has chosen Jerusalem rebuke you. And Lord, as we tear down the strongholds of evil in our city, in our community, we pray from Jeremiah 1.10 to root out and to pull down, to destroy and to throw down and to build and to plant. Father, your kingdom come, your will be done in our city, in our community, in our families. Let your awesome presence Drive back this present darkness. Heal our land. In the name of the one who came to destroy the works of the devil, Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen.